Hello, Barry Bailey here with a legless lizard. Some of the old folks call them joint snakes, hoop snakes, and they had all kinds of superstitions about them. I don't know, some of them may have been true. Back in the old days, things were different than they are now. Things got were a lot bigger and a lot older. This is a, a hoop snake, or a joint snake, or a lizard snake. And uh, this one has lost its tail, and they wriggle. They're very, very uh, wriggling animals, and this is their defense mechanism. They wriggle to get away, and in the process, their tail breaks off, and their tail wriggles away like this in the opposite direction, dancing and, and jumping. And so the aggressor goes after the tail, and the snake gets away. And so that's how these animals survive. As you can see, its tail has already been broken off, but it will grow it back in a few weeks, and he'll start his wriggling now if I don't put him back in his pen. And I don't want him to hurt him, because his tail's already been broken off, and he has to go into a kind of a, uh, a rest period to uh, let his tail grow back. But this is uh, a very rare creature here in Georgia now. Um, they're... they're uh, there, nobody knows how many they are because they're very, uh, uh, they hide under the rocks and stuff and, and it's hard to see them at times. Uh, this one was laying in the road, someone that had run over its head and I thought it was dead. And when I went to pick it up to uh, rescue it, it started wriggling and its tail broke off. And uh, I was made aware again of how uh, these creatures wriggle. They wriggle, so don't pick one up if you see one, if you possibly can avoid picking it up. Uh, try to make it, uh, if it's injured somewhere on the road, you try to brush it up into a uh, pillowcase or something like that. And that way you can uh, uh, safely transport it somewhere else. This one I did, I thought it was dead. It had been run over by its head and it wasn't moving. And uh, I put it in the sack, and then when I went to take it out, it came to, and it started wriggling like crazy, and its tail broke off, and I was... I really hated that because I wanted to uh, be keeping them all intact. But uh, so that is their defense mechanism. It, it didn't really hurt him. It just it has to grow another one. And so um, I'll feed him on um, uh, large insects like grasshoppers and, and uh, maybe some small frogs and stuff like that. And things that lizards eat because it is a lizard. Uh, and this is the lizard snake. They get about maybe two possibly two and a half feet long uh, and they're very uh, very unusual creatures as you could see so uh, I'm not going to pick him up again but he is a very unusual creature the lizards